All right, guys. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to grow your connections and grow your brand, grow your visibility, get more leads, get more uh, projects, get more clients uh, from LinkedIn, right? And uh, uh, the the first step uh, in the 5C framework, uh, as uh, we are we are uh, you know digging deep now, is always uh, going to grow our network organically uh, by adding and reaching out to more people, growing our connections, right? So uh, 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 let me quickly explain to you uh, if you don't already know the difference between Facebook and LinkedIn uh, in terms of connections right and in terms of uh, visibility uh, so uh, so the more people you have uh, okay so the the, the first basic uh, difference is that on Facebook you can only have up to like 5,000 uh, friends right 5,000 connections uh, but on LinkedIn right you can have up to 30000 connections and beyond that all can be your followers uh, and on facebook after 5000 friends they can be your followers but on linkedin you can add up to 30000 connections so that really gives you uh, you know uh, like a huge uh, opportunity to to build your network over time right so you can use this platform as a really long term uh, solution to to const to like to consistently work on uh, growing a network, reaching out to people, and and you know building relationships. So that's something that you can do on LinkedIn. Um, so no, uh, so as you can see, I have six thousand friends already, or followers already on on LinkedIn, uh, and uh, you know over five hundred plus connections. So uh, how to how to uh, grow our network on LinkedIn, right? So the 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 first thing that you do is you you go on my network option uh, over here on the top, and then you click on connections right so once you do that uh, linkedin will now open uh, the list of connections that i already have right so if you see uh, i have over 6510 connections on linkedin and this is all uh, uh, so by the way it did not take me a lot of time to do this I, it just took me one year right uh, trust me every day i used to add at least 100 people uh, of, uh on linkedin and uh, uh I, this is how i uh, i i grew my my network right so uh, it's very easy to to grow uh like your connections on linkedin very fast but yes uh engaging with them uh, nurturing them is is going to be a bit uh, more uh you know uh, time consuming and it will take a lot more effort because it, it, it's purely going to be based on your content and how uh, you you engage with your with your audience uh, and how you communicate with them right but growing your network on linkedin can uh, happen very fast so you click on network and you click on connections now uh, uh, if, if you're an agency owner if you are a service-based business owner is looking to reach out to specific type of people right or specific industry specific uh you know uh like uh, like like a niche right uh so LinkedIn is much more uh, advanced in terms of reaching out or finding those people like targeted uh, compared to Facebook where of course you do have to uh, find those targeted groups but even uh, there there is a possibility that you know a lot of people are still just like you right trying to look for business so it's it still is a bit more challenging uh, uh, to, to find the exact uh, type of person on Facebook uh even in, even on facebook groups right but on linkedin that's not the case you exactly know who the type of people you're going to add and that's uh, what you what you get right so uh, how to how to find uh, the what we're looking for on linkedin right so we click over here uh, search with filters and if you see uh, linkedin will now uh, give a list of all the all the filters right so uh, if you see on the top left the first option is people right so there are a lot of other options as well you, you can search uh, for jobs, posts, companies, schools, groups, events, courses, and services. So these are all different types of uh, things uh, or options that LinkedIn get. Uh, LinkedIn gives you. Uh, the next is connections, right? Uh, like the first degree connection, second degree, and third degree connections. The first degree connections are the one that are directly connected to you, uh, and they are part of a network, right? So I have first degree. I have six thousand first degree connections. So we are connected on LinkedIn. Second degree connections are are connections of the first degree uh, connections right like they know uh, like these are the people who are are all friends with uh, my my first degree connections right uh, so that's how linkedin calculates that and the third degree connections are all the people who are friends of my second degree connection so that's how kind of it it, it gives like a layered uh, filter 
so uh, you can choose the first two or you can choose all three up to you and you can uh, click show results now you still need to to filter out right now if you see uh, these are you know all the total people that uh, you know uh, that are part of my first second third degree connections that that linkedin is able to find now uh, the next filter that linkedin gives you is the location filter now this is very powerful because if you're an agency owner if you're a service based business owner looking to uh, find international clients right uh, yeah, then this is a very great way because you can immediately uh, uh, like choose uh, uh, like uh, like a country like for example australia or maybe united kingdom right so this is how you uh, how you you find uh, uh, like companies or leads or prospects or you know connections on on linkedin from a specific country right so even uae is a very good option uh, especially if you are from uh, from Asia, right? But again, if if you are so, someone from US, then you might want to choose US. Or if you are someone from uh, you know Europe, then you want to accordingly target people from from here uh, as per the location, right? So once you click show results, now these three filters are already activated, uh, which is the people connections or location. So this is precisely what linkedin is giving me right again for uh, you know th these are the uh, like total number of results now this is where the fun starts right so now if we click all filters over here linkedin will further help us uh, like identify the type of industry we're looking to target right this is very powerful because it will allow us to to specifically find uh, uh, you know uh, 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 like a niche or, or an industry that we only want to work with like for example we only want to work with real estate so if i just choose real estate over here it will see commercial real estate and real estate so if you're an agency owner looking to work with only real estate then you can choose this right and if i now click show results right uh, i click show results and see 415 results from these three locations so now i can just start to uh, you know reach out to these people right uh, i can start connecting with them so uh, uh you know uh, before i show you what to send them i'll again uh, go a bit more deep on on the on the filters right so if you see there are so many different types of filters now uh i've i've uh, gone ahead and give, uh, i'm i'm also kind of i i did some research and i'm also giving you the list of all the possible filters uh not so, not filter sorry the uh, all the possible industries that that you can uh, search on 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 this particular filter right because linkedin doesn't give that uh, i mean because obviously they have so many industries that they do not uh, uh, they want to keep things simple in terms of the ui or the software so um, the next best thing that they're doing is like adding a plus industry over here and then you just have to search it but uh, like how do we know what are the industries uh, so this is where uh, you know uh, you know i just did some research and i i found this list right so if you see information technology and services these are the total number of people that linkedin has in in, in the network right hospital and healthcare they are total number of people 15 million right so construction retail education management all the possible niches uh, that that you know uh, uh, exist in the world are are over here right even restaurants restaurant owners right pharmaceuticals and uh, you know uh, like mining and metals every industry like right? Air, airlines and aviation and uh, you know you, you whatever you think you can you can find uh, in this particular list you can even search by pressing control f and you can just search for real estate if you see i just uh, typed real estate and this is how i found commercial real estate uh, we, we just found that on linkedin filter as well so uh, wine and spirits like every particular industry is over here i'm also going to give you the link for this in in this document right so now this document that i'm going to share with you uh, this is the same link that uh, i just showed you over here now what you need to do is you need to reach out to these people right so i'm giving you two scripts both the scripts are very uh, uh, you know mild or light in tone and uh, most it, it's a very high chance that uh, people will accept your 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 connection request because this is a, these are the same scripts that i've used to grow my network to 6000 uh, followers right uh, 6000 connections so two scripts you can use either or uh, based on which one gives you most results 
and uh, you know it's it's uh, pretty straightforward hey name uh, i just came across a profile and i'm really impressed with the work you're doing so we are what you're actually trying to do is just trying to appreciate them and letting them know that uh, you know uh, whatever work they're doing and it's, it's pretty broad right you you may not uh, you like you need not need to read a lot about them because it will take a lot, a lot like a lot of time right if you keep doing that for a lot of people it will use a lot of your time so just keep it simple uh, when you say work you're doing it can mean a lot of things right like a job that they're part of or a post that they uh, recently posted or or anything else so this particular uh, uh, statement or line covers a lot of different angles so a, a person if if, we, if they just read it they'll not think twice and they'll just accept it right and would love to connect with you so this is uh, uh, something that you can just send them and regards your name right so i can just show that to you i am just copying this and i'm just going to kind of uh, send this to this particular person over here uh, connect add a note remember if you just click send without adding a note then it will not uh, look good and this person may not uh, increase your uh, may not accept your friend request or connection request but if you uh, send a friend request or connection request by sending a note then it really increases your chances of being accepted by the other person right uh, because it, it will look really professional and professionalism is a, a very important on a platform like linkedin on facebook you can uh, afford to be a bit more casual but on linkedin uh, you know you really have to uh, try and strive to be a bit more professional even in terms of your content right uh, but we will we'll talk about that in the upcoming models for now just try to keep this particular uh, um, uh, uh, script uh, simple and just paste it over here and i'm not going to send it if you remember this is something that i still have to change so i'm just going to carefully uh, I'm like take this slow right don't send a wrong name over here or send it with stuff like this right else it will look like you're using tools or bots and stuff like that and it will not be a good first impression and first impression is everything right so hey mezen m-a-z-e-n just make sure that the spelling is correct you don't want to spell m-e-z-e-n right because uh, in in hurry sometimes you do all these uh, you know very uh, tiny minor mistakes and again it, it, it doesn't really uh, look good so amazon i just came across your profile and i'm really impressed with the work you're doing would love to connect with you and yeah uh, uh, you know i have made these mistakes by the way i have incorrectly spelled out the wrong name and all that and i've got you know like uh, not a good uh, response uh, so just avoid doing all these things so hey mezen i came across your profile and i'm really impressed with the work you're doing would love to connect with you regards ankit modi if you want you can also uh, like uh, the second line you can also put your designation co-founder so that you know it again builds an, an authority that you are the owner right you're not some random person co-founder co at six figure consulting so when you uh, when you give your company name it also kind of indirectly creates that uh, that brand awareness in his mind that okay this particular person maybe owns a consulting agency uh, and it, it's there in, in the back of his head may not obviously be uh, uh, you know like he may not remember it but he'll know that okay you're your uh, your company owner of a consulting agency so that's how you can send it and uh, just click send and that's it if you do this for the next uh, you know 10 to 20 people then it should be good to go uh, he Muhammad Tahir, right? So I think yeah, Muhammad is his name. Uh, Muhammad, and I will just send it again. Marketing manager, so I'm just going to send this to him as well. So just giving an example of how easy this is, and this is all you have to do. Again, uh, if you are someone who's been in the industry for a long time, yes, I know there are tools to do this. There are uh, systems to do this particular job uh, that, that sends a request automatically for you and it's all automated, right? Everything can be done auto, uh, you know, on an automated basis. I know all that, but I'm just trying to show you uh, organic and free ways where, where you can just 
put in some time and effort especially if you're starting out and if you want to just learn more first rather before moving into the the, the advanced automation and all that stuff and then you can uh, you know use all that but for now just try to do this manually or till you till you yourself get a hang of things and then you can uh, use automations when you start uh, when you want to really scale fast right so again just quickly going to send this just to uh, give you an idea on how easy it is how fast it is even if you do it automatically right so one two three four four requests send in less than a minute right so this is how you do it on linkedin and uh, this is the list of all the industries that you can uh, potentially tap and again you don't need to go crazy with this list just focus on one niche at a time and uh, if you uh, i'm sure by this by the time you're watching this video you already know which niche you are going to work at but if you don't know then you can choose from this particular list right over here and uh, just start with uh, uh, like just, just start reaching out to them start working with them and then decide if that niche is something that you really uh, you know uh, like uh, ready to explore more or you want to change a particular niche right so even training and coaching is over here right so if you're a coach for, for sure this this uh, is, is something that can help you as well right so that being said uh, i hope this particular video was helpful and uh, again uh, uh, like the, the the target is to send at least 50 to 80 per day that's how you will scale faster right because if you keep growing your network fast daily that means there is a potential of business uh, very soon right so with that being said thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you in the next one